To this on Church Street. Thank you for joining us. I'm Darren Perrin. And I'm Kiana Burks in for CAT. WCAX has learned three more businesses are leaving downtown Burlington following other recent departures and adding to the number of vacant storefronts. And that has city officials wondering what will happen as the holiday season heats up. Our Aikman David is live on Church Street. Ike, which stores are headed out of Burlington now? Yeah, today I learned that Black Diamond, the body shop in Slate, have all announced that they're closing, leaving questions in the business community about the economic health of downtown Burlington. Empty storefronts scattered around Burlington's downtown. The state of Church Street is a bit depressing. Sarah Visaveri spent the morning catching up with some friends downtown. They said some of the shops they were looking for are gone. It might be a little bit of the weather, but just to walk on the streets and not see the stores we're used to. Comments like that in images of for rent signs scattered in the downtown have business leaders concerned. Sales volumes are down. Kelly Devine of the Burlington Business Association points to a number of factors for the decline. Public safety concerns, a shortage of workers and fewer people working in downtown offices to provide regular foot traffic to supplement tourists. We are in still in this post pandemic period where a lot of offices, people are working remotely. And with each business that leaves, there's one less reason for shoppers to visit. Devine says this will be a critical holiday season for remaining businesses that are barely hanging on. A good handful of businesses that really are making that calculation every day and a strong holiday season will certainly make them decide to stay. But help is on the way. The city says some current empty locations have new tenants moving in. Downtowns face challenges and we are facing challenges, but I am seeing very strong interest in opening of new businesses. One of the reasons people shop downtown is because it's a pleasant, interesting environment. Economist Art Wolf says it's already hard to run a business, but battling labor issues, foot traffic and theft concerns make it even harder. The City Place project now under construction promises to bring hundreds of new residents to the city, which could provide a needed boost for commerce. If more people were living downtown, um, There'd obviously be a captive market for all sorts of retailing and, and hospitality. But business leaders and shoppers say Burlington also needs to combat a growing image that it's not a safe place, especially at night. I mean, 11 a.m. in the morning, sure. I won't come down here at night. I'll choose a restaurant in South Burlington or Shelburne or Essex or Colchester over coming downtown. Uh, some shops are already getting into the holiday spirit, decorating their windows and their stores. I am told the holiday tree is expected to arrive next week. Reporting live in Burlington, I'm Ben David, Channel 3 News.